morning, good morning, good morning to everyone in Nationwide. Welcome to another live broadcast on EEW, Evangelism I Watched, with your host, Evangelist Joan Evans da Costa, coming to you live out of Montego Bay, Jamaica. It is a beautiful day to give God thanks in Nationwide. This is a day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice in it and be glad. Father, we thank you for another brand new week. We thank you for another wonderful day. We thank you for our families in this nation. Lord, we ask you to bless the leaders of this nation. Give them peace, give them joy, and give them guidance to lead us through wisdom, justice, and knowledge from above. Lord, as we pray under the open heaven this morning, we ask you, Lord, that you will protect everyone as we go about our daily routines. Lord, we ask you, Lord, that we will never be lack. And whatever good you have in store for this nation, Lord, we will continue to build on Jamaica land we love. Lord, thank you, Lord, that you are a God who never fail. You are a God of compassion. You are a God of mercy. And when man say no, God say yes. So today, Lord, we just shabak you and we give you the glory and we give you the honor. Thy kingdom come and your will be done in this hurt. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. Thank you all again. Another wonderful morning, another beautiful week. The topic this morning, God is active and alive. We don't serve a dead God. We serve a true and living God. The kingdom of God is at hand. What are you waiting for? The kingdom of God is at hand. What are you waiting for? The time is now. Get active and spread the gospel of the kingdom of God. Trust in God's plan. Lead by his command to spread the gospel of the kingdom in nationwide. God came that we might have life. God gave his son Jesus Christ that we may have life and have it abundantly. Adam had it and he lost it. Hence God had to send his son Jesus Christ to die for us so that we can continue with the mission and purpose in nationwide. The gospel of the kingdom must preach in all the earth realm and then God's will and purpose will be done in this earth. Amen. Hallelujah. Nothing should take the place of God's will for our lives. Let us embrace the call to spread the gospel of the kingdom of God, the pure, undiluted word of God. Hallelujah. The call to spread the gospel is not one, it's not a one way street, but it is the act of surrendering your life for good, walking in the fullness and the promises of God. It is a reminder that he is in control, that the timing is perfect and the timing is now. All we are hearing today is political affairs and political um, points and political merit. But I'm saying to Nationwide this morning that the word of God reminds us that if our people were called by his name, will turn from their wicked ways, hear from him, you know, seek thy face and turn to God, then God himself will hear from us and heal our nation. Hallelujah. So this morning, the, the, the promise is to spread the gospel of the kingdom of God. The, there's an urgency in the land for the word of God. And those of us who are called by his name must decree and declare a thing and it shall come to pass. And that thing that thing, that perfect will is not to neglect this great salvation, but to continue to spread the gospel of the kingdom of God. Wait on the Lord and seek him wholeheartedly. Hallelujah. It is the Lord mercy that we are not consumed because his compassion never fail. They are new every morning. God's love and compassion are new every morning. The nature of God is infinite, eternal, and unchangeable. 
God has never changed. He is sustain. He's a sustainer of the living things, all of creation. God is a sustainer. Hallelujah. Thank you this morning. Jesus is the creation of all things. Think about the many things we have done to this creation, to planet Earth, the damages, the killings, the many hurting people traversing the hurt rim, men moving about, you know, like a roaring lion seeking who to destroy and who to devour. But God has purpose this morning. God has given us chance over ch chance, many chance over and over. God is still waiting for that man, that woman who will say, yes, Lord, here I am. Forgive me, Lord, for neglecting this great salvation. I am ready and willing to declare the gospel of the kingdom of God. It's not that he will not put in his appearance, but he cannot and he will not until the promise of God is fulfilled. The gospel of the kingdom must be declared in all the earth. The time is not no, the time is fast approaching and the will of God must be done. Hallelujah. God is not, God is active and alive. We don't serve a dead God. God is not reactive. He is proactive. He sees our end from the beginning. Reaction can be hasty and self-serving. You know, people love to be impulsive, quick. To quick to take action without spiritual eyes we become blinded and walk out of the prophetic advancement of god this morning i'm saying to you in nationwide motion without direction is a risk motion without direction is a risk lack the wisdom of spiritual sight can send you into redundancy hallelujah glory to god this morning, as I close in nationwide, faith and the willingness to surrender everything to him should not be hard. God is always at work. Even when we can't see it, God's timing is perfect. The kingdom of God must be heard in all of the earth for his perfect will to be done in this earth. I am just getting to the point this morning and I hope you were blessed to tell you people of God and those who are not yet a part of the kingdom of God, get on board. It is time to get on board and, and declare the gospel of the kingdom of God in this nation because there is work to be done. The time is now. The time is winding out. The time is fastly approaching. People in nationwide, do not neglect this great salvation. Continue to decree and declare the things of God. Continue to spread the word of God. The gospel of the kingdom is at hand. From the day of John the Baptist, the church of God suffered violence, but the violence was and take it by force. We are going to take it to the street. We are going to take it to the nation. The gospel of the God of God must be fulfilled in this nation. You have a fulfilled blessed week in nationwide. God bless you as I deliver what the Lord ordained us to deliver. Nothing but the gospel of the kingdom of God. Bless you, catch you, love you, walk good.